the book Living Prayer by Metropolitan Anthony Bloom talks about these beautiful insights into having a healthy, a, a living prayer life uh, with God. And one of the chapters includes a quote about the judgment. And it's a reminder about the importance of humility in our, our walk with God. Earlier this summer, in our church's annual summer reading group, we looked at the book Living Prayer by Metropolitan Anthony Bloom. It's a beautiful book. It's my favorite of his works that talks about, in just very simple language, it's not even a long book, but it just talks about these beautiful insights into having a healthy, a, a living prayer life uh, with God. And one of the chapters includes a quote from St. Ambrose of Optina. And this is about the judgment, and it's a reminder about the importance of humility in our spiritual life, in our, our walk with God. And I remember when I first read this quote, it just gave me so much hope. It just gave me so much encouragement uh, in my own spiritual life. So this is Metropolitan Anthony quoting St. Ambrose. Metropolitan Anthony writes, Ambrose of Optina, one of the last Russian Stadets said once that two categories of men will attain salvation. Those who sin and are strong enough to repent, and those who are too weak even to repent truly, but are prepared patiently, humbly, and gratefully to bear all the weight of the consequences of their sins. In their humility, they are acceptable to God. What wonderful words as we struggle with our own sins, particularly our habitual sins, that ultimately the thing that opens the floodgates of God's mercy is that we embrace a humble heart. Before and above all else, may we cultivate a spirit of humility. Anybody who can cultivate that spirit, anybody who can go through lives with a humble heart, is capable of salvation and eternal joy.